So the only guy that really gave me trouble so far was Zaldin, or whatever his name was. That guy at uh, Beast's Castle. Give that guy, he was a pain. Where is my heart? Just die. Thank you. Don't be sad. That guy was a douche. It's good that he's dead. I don't get it. Why has everybody been calling me Roxas? Because, Sora. Roxas is your nobody. My... nobody? But that's crazy. I never turned into a heart... Yeah, you did. Oh. Right. Whoops. It was when you came to rescue me. Remember? Xemnas was the one who found Roxas. He could use the Keyblade because he was your nobody. That's why Xemnas brought him into the organization. But Roxas betrayed them. After that, I fought him because I thought it would help you wake up. I lost. But the next time we met, I made sure I was the stronger one. Maybe I didn't need to fight him after all. I think he left the organization because he really wanted to meet you. Roxas. I wish I could meet him too. All right, let's go. What a touching little cutscene there. Now we've got another report. We've got more people to talk to. Some random inputs, I'm sure. I'm exhausted. Let's rest before we go. I don't know where we, we would rest. I wonder what this castle was built for. It's pretty mysterious. So all of you were out adventuring while I was living a normal life. Why do I always get left out? You're going to have to tell me about it later. Sure. I met Roxas because of a guy named Diz. I didn't trust Diz at first, but we both needed each other's help. Sure, Kyrie. We'll go out and have uh, we'll have dinner. Be a nice little date. Happy ending and all. Back out we go. Is that door open? Oh, Kyrie was kind of looking at it. That door very well could be open. Let's jump in there real quick for no real reason. And so the magical door is no longer magical. It's just question marks, and we'll go through it. Get another cutscene since the music kind of dropped off. Still doing that special beam cannon, I see. Answer? <laughs> I'm a fool. I spent years studying the workings of the heart. Yet it seems I still haven't learned a thing. What do you mean? The process of encoding hearts is incalculable. The inhabitants of my twilight town were data created from real hearts. I was convinced that they would think and behave the way I had envisioned. But I couldn't have been more wrong. A heart is so much more than any system. I saw it when Roxas and Kyrie crossed paths. I knew, but I was too stubborn to accept it. It's always the same. I try to wrap my mind around things my heart already knows, only to fail. While I was trying to bring Sora back, I had so many plans in store. But once Sora was an acting force, they fell apart. All my research amounted to nothing compared with that one boy's heart. Ansem, a machine! All the more proof that hearts cannot be contained by data. Run, my friend! It's going to self-destruct, and anything could happen. But, Your Majesty! Sora. The rest is up to you. And Roxas, I doubt you can hear me, but I am sorry. Ansem! My heart is telling me what I must do. Please allow me to do what it says. No! 
Riku! His heart's decided. We can't change that. I was wondering who would dare interfere with my kingdom hearts. And Xehanort. Here you all are. How convenient for me. Ansem the Wise. You look pathetic. Have your love. I deserve as much for failing to see you for the fool you are. Students do take after their teachers. Only a fool would be your apprentice. After all, none of this would have happened without you. You are the source of all heartless. It was your research that inspired me to go further than you ever dared. I admit, my disregard brought chaos to more worlds than one. But what were you seeking? You erased me from the world, only to take my name and continue research better left forgotten. Is this the answer you've been looking for? All that and more. I'm carrying on what you yourself began, and I'm creating a brand new world, one heart at a time. I thought you'd praise me, but all you ever do is hold me back. I understand, though. Unlike me, you have a heart, and you're powerless to control it, consumed by the jealousy you feel toward the student who surpassed you. They are not foolish apprentice of a foolish man. You have surpassed nothing, only proved how little we both know. We may profess to know the heart, but its essence is beyond our reach. We're both ignorant, as oblivious as when we began. I'm afraid that any world you try to create, any world of yours, would be an empire of ignorance. That is why you and your creation are destined to fall. We've said enough. Rico, you know what to do. King Mickey, my friend, forgive me. Farewell. Something's about to go down. Uh oh. Riku's just holding everyone back. Oh, come on, you couldn't hold that many people back. Maybe you should go away from the incredibly blinding light. And whatever the hell just happened. The swirling vortex of doom that has appeared. It's like heart confetti that creates heartless. And that is a lot of heartless. Another army descends upon everything and its mom. Hey, you got changed back. Riku. He's got like a blindfold over his eyes for some reason. Wow. wow. Riku. Uh, uh, Ansem did say anything could happen. Yeah, so what's with the blindfold? Riku, you gonna take that off? Oh.
What was that? His eyes couldn't lie. Lie? And just who were you trying to fool? Huh? Huh? Myself. Riku, come on, man. Why did you try to do so much on your own? You've got friends, like us. It's a very misfit bunch, I'll say that. Yep. A very misfit bunch. Have you forgotten? I'll tell you why. Because I'm not a total sap like you. Say that again. I'm gonna shove that keyblade down your throat if you keep saying shit, Riku. Oh damn, Heartless Army. What should we do, Riku? We must defeat Zemnis. We can give up. He's the organization's last survivor. Right. I'm throwing the towel. Oh, wow, that was Come on. That was quick. Didn't know he was wearing that under that. I mean, I thought he looked cooler with the black robes on, but, uh, whatever. Hey, we got Riku. I think I'll keep Riku. Even though I don't like his outfit, I really don't care. I'm not one to judge. I'm not going to sit someone out based upon their outfit. But I do wish he was wearing the black robe. But at any rate... Oh, here's the Berserker guy. Great. Well, what I'm gonna do... I'm gonna Berserk. Get rid of this guy. There we go. Doing the same shit I was doing before. Oh, he's dead. Good. They're just gonna keep spawning. Well, when we come back next time, we'll go ahead and go to defeat Xehanort. And uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do next time.